By the end of this video, you will know how to play any previous version of Fortnite, including replaying live events such as Mech vs. The Devourer or the Travis Scott concert. There are chapters in this video and links in the description to help speed things along for you. Before we get ahead of ourselves, I need to share some caveats with you. This will not get you banned. Everything is run locally. There are no cosmetics. They used to allow you to wear any skin in the game, but Epic Games reached out saying, as long as you remove cosmetics, you can keep the server going. This is 100% safe. Rift is the name of the tool we'll be using to play old seasons of Fortnite. Rift contains a DLL that provides you with a built-in private server. This is falsely flagged by Windows Defender. I'll show you how to get around this. Rift is completely safe and it's super fun. Let's get started. You will need the following tools installed to set things up. If you already have these, you can skip ahead to the next section. Let's install 7-Zip. Open a web browser and search for 7-Zip. Click on the download link in the results. Click on the first download link. Open it. Select yes. Click install. And then click close. You're done. Let's install Discord next. Open a web browser and search for Discord. Click on the download link. And then click on download for Windows. Then open the download. Let it install. Now you're ready to log in or create an account. It's that easy. Next, let's join the Rift Discord server. Open a browser and search Rift Discord. Click on the first link and Discord will open. Select join and you're in. Now we'll install .NET Core. Open the Rift Discord server. Click on the download channel. Scroll to the top and click on the .NET Core 3 download link. This will open a browser and start the download immediately. When it's done, click Setup, Yes, and then wait for it to finish. Then hit Close. Now let's download Rift. Open Discord, go back to the download channel, and click on the latest build of Rift download. Start your download, and you're going to get an error, failed virus detected. Open the prompt, Click on Protection History. Click on Threat Blocked. Select Yes. Select Actions and click Allow. Now go back to your web browser. Click on Refresh. Download again and it'll work this time. Show in folder. Now right click for the context menu, select 7-zip and extract to the directory name. Now we're going to create a new directory on the desktop. We're going to call it old Fortnite. Drag your Rift folder into the old Fortnite folder and you're ready to go. Now let's download an old build of Fortnite. Open a web browser and search for Fortnite Builds. Click on the GitHub link, a lot of builds. Here you will find a lot of Fortnite builds, starting with pre-Battle Royale, Season 0, Season 1, and on and on. We're going to download a build from Season 1. Click on the download link, then click on the download button and select download anyways. When it's done downloading, click show in folder and then right click for the context menu, select 7-zip and extract to folder. Once it's done extracting, grab the Fortnite build folder and drag it into your old Fortnite folder on the desktop. We're almost there. Next, we're going to add the Fortnite build we just downloaded to Rift. Open up the old Fortnite folder on your desktop and open up the Rift directory. Double click on the Rift application. Select Yes. Select Allow Access. Select Accept Conditions and select Next. Hit Next again. Now choose the game path. We're going to navigate to the old Fortnite folder on our desktop, then the Fortnite build, Fortnite, Fortnite again, and then select folder. Give it a name, 
and then select Next. Now we're ready to launch. Let's use Rift to launch our build of Fortnite. Open up the old Fortnite directory, click on Rift, and double click on the Rift application. You'll see your Fortnite build, click it to launch Fortnite. Okay, we're in the game. Let's wait for it to load. And there's that famous OG Fortnite music. Click on Battle Royale, and you'll get a pop-up telling you that to join a game, you have to press F3. Press F3 to join the game. And we're in. We made it back to Chapter 1, Season 1, OG Fortnite. Let's learn how to use commands so that we can add items to our games or kick off live events. Open Discord and let's go back to the Rift Discord server. Click on the Commands channel for an overview of all the commands that are available. Once you learn how to use commands, click on the Paste Bin link at the bottom for a list of all the items that you can spawn into your game. This link has a list of all the items from all the seasons that you could add into your Fortnite game. Go ahead and pick one out now, and we're gonna add it in the next step. Once you're back in the game, press the command button on your keyboard, paste your command, press enter, and then your item will appear. I just spawned in a gold scar. A couple more things to keep in mind. You can play any season that you can find a build for. You can also replay any events, including the Galactus event, Mecha vs. The Devourer, Travis Scott, etc. Well, I hope you've enjoyed this, and if you have, please subscribe for more gaming content.